Let me talk to you about my favorite investment. So a lot of people know me as king of Flexspace. I build Flexspace all over the country. I love office warehouses. I love the industrial product. Um, it is my favorite asset class. But today, in this video, I'm going to talk about my best investment. So I actually, I think, am known for my $1 to $16 million uh, transaction in which I took a $1 million and then I sold for $16 million. That is probably my best investment. That is probably my favorite investment. Now, a lot of people don't realize that in order to get to that number, you have to take on a lot of debt. People re usually think, which is funny to me, is that I took a million dollars and I literally sold for $16 million and that means I netted $15 million. That just doesn't make sense. In order to do that, in order to get to that number, I actually had to take debt on three separate times to get to that number. The first time I developed the project, I had a million dollars. I took debt for three million, so the total construction cost at that point was four million dollars. I then reappraised that project. Uh, I think it appraised for like six million or so, which means I had a little bit of equity built into the development. That is when I was able to take on more debt to continue the development, and I did so until I was able to continue it, finish it, finalize that project, and then exit out at 16 million. Now, in reality, I didn't even exit at 16 million. I exited prior to that uh, because I got an offer that was just too good to refuse. So I, I didn't even complete the development all the way to 16 million. The new buyers then, of course, con continued it. And today that development is worth well over $16 million because they took the added risk that needed to be taken in order to complete it and develop the area around it.